Hey guys, what's going on? This is Langston John Blaze, and this is like take 40. Um, <laughs> I wanted to, I guess what I wanted to talk to you guys about today was finding yourself and finding yourself before you get involved with someone. And not only just, I wouldn't say not only just finding yourself, but just being content with yourself as a person in order to be able to give yourself to someone else if you're thinking about being in a relationship. Um, I would say I'm of a generation where we are so built on being in a relationship. I don't know what is the fixation about it, um, being with so-and-so, what does so-and-so think about the way that I look, is my hair in the right spot for them to see me. It's almost like a job and as beautiful as a relationship is, it takes a lot of work to build yourself up to a person and to be able to present yourself to that person to say, hey, I want to be with you. I don't think that people really get what that means when they say that, that they want to be with someone, especially I would say people between 18 and 25 the most are so fixated on, on what it is to be in love and what it really means to be in love. and. Honestly, I think that it takes a certain amount of self-love to later on be able to involve yourself with someone and within that time, because sometimes you can be in a relationship and not technically, it doesn't mean that you're in love. If you're in a relationship with someone, you can, um, Jurassic Park song, a little distracted, um, you can... You can be with someone throughout the process of a relationship and grow to love them that way. But my thing is just, my thing is this, people. There is a certain amount of love that we need to have for ourselves before we even think for even the this, this, this shimmer of a thought <laughs> that you can love somebody else. Because to be able to, to find yourself, I think, is a very powerful thing. Um, but to find yourself while you're involved with someone else is, to, to me, it, it's like putting your relationship in doom. I think that there's a certain order that it takes to develop a relationship and to develop yourself. I think there's a certain amount of development that you need within you before you decide to get with so-and-so. And we're, we're not going to always know exactly who it is that we think that we are. Um, when it comes to our careers, when it comes to our personal selves, our, our basic life decisions, there are things that we have to experience in order to realize, okay, this is what I want to do and this is who I am. And to do that and be in a relationship, to try to dedicate yourself to someone else at the same time, dedicate the attention that you need for you is a mission impossible. Yeah, that, that's just the way I see it. Maybe it, it works for some people and it's a little bit tougher to to try to balance both. But I think that in truth, there takes amount there takes amount of discovery within you and a certain amount of love that I think that we as people are missing most definitely that that we need to develop before we involve ourselves with someone else that we're supposed to love you know so I guess my message tonight is is love yourself and to find yourself before you get involved with someone else because that's another person that needs love um, externally but you need that love internally first before you can be somebody's boo <laughs> you need to be your own boo there needs to be Matter of fact, okay, I'm going to put it like this. Every night before you go to bed, when you're in the mirror brushing your teeth and you're washing your face and you're doing whatever it is that you do in the bathroom, you need to look at yourself like I'm looking at you right now and say I love you to you. As crazy as that sounds, that's what you need to do because you need to know yourself that you have that amount of of care, that amount of consideration 
that amount of respect for yourself before you get involved with someone else that you're supposed to look in the eye and say that I care about you, that I want to be with you, that I love you. That's very important to me. All right? So this is Langston John Blaze signing off. Until next time, peace.